Hi High Tech Legion, this is Skate and Eric here today to show you the newest case from Inwin. This is their Buck case. Uh, the concept that they have behind this is that it's a shielded heart. and it, Basically uh, what, it, what I can see from this is it's a very feature rich affordable gaming case uh, that incorporates all of the Inwin features that you've pretty much come to know and love with a lot of their higher end cases but in a more compact design here. So looking at the front here what we can see is we have uh, the nice IO uh, panel right here there's um, eSATA and you got two USB your 3.5 millimeter here power button and reset um, we have the expanded ports here uh, these are removable just by these front clips here just pulls right off and right back in there um, there are three and then we have the optional two and a half millimeter right down here below or, sorry, two and a half inch. Um, down here is a nice mesh grill as well that does have a lighted LED right up here. It's a red LED uh, to show off the case. And this is pretty much the front, and now we'll move on to the side. Now the side here kind of features some of the, the nice things that we've come to know and love with in-wind cases. Uh, we have this big giant mesh grill that covers the, pretty much the entire side here, but it also has the um, expansion 120 millimeter fans. And then the neat thing about this case is their hot, the hot swap bays that it allows, but they did it a little better this time with this case, whereas in before they had that little flappy door, now they put in a cool locking mechanism. Uh, you basically, they supply you with a key here, and you pop it in, and then open it up, and then you have the nice hot swap hard drive bays right here that are easily accessed. And then the case sides here, instead of using uh, thumb screws, they have their clip mechanisms that just pop off and then alright now here's a close look at the interior of the case here uh, what we get is a tool free design completely well not utterly completely but a, a tool free design nonetheless uh, we have the nice knobs here on your um, drive bays here now these are they sell these separately but you can see these basically um, are tension and what you have to do is actually mount the hard drive in here which you'll see on the install um, and then after that's done these are easily hot swappable in and out but also on the back end which you'll see on the other side um, they all they have the 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 communication ports basically your SATA connections already mounted in the back here so you don't need any extra um, SATA connections now looking around we have the large CPU cutout here nice big um, big CPU cutout for heat sink swappability um, we get 120 millimeter fan on the back end for exhaust and then also 120 millimeter fan on top for the expansion ports these are also tool free as well you push in the button it's the sliding mechanism here and then these are replaceable brackets and then on the bottom bottom mount PSU but they also have right here the mesh cleanable grill that um, so you can mount the PSU fan down and get fresh air in there there are also cable mounting holes we have two right here we got uh, one right in the middle here and then one right on the top here and then all in the tippy top there's another routing hole and then one right above the motherboard here there's quite a few cable routing holes to hide your cables And then this just gives you a better look at the opposite side here. We have the CPU cutout there. We have the cable routing holes, which they've already mounted their uh, front port cables through there. So there's no need to change it if you like that configuration. And then we have the expandable, expandable bays here. You can see you got one, two, three, four of them total here that already have the cables included. You just pop them right into your motherboard there, uh, the power connection and then they ran the SATA cables already through there and then looking on top here we can see the mesh grill for the top 120 millimeter fan but they've also has they have a nice tray here uh, where you can rest your docks your bays all that uh, 
enclosures, that sort of thing, because the USB 3.0 port is right there. So, if you have docks, you have enclosures, you use them, you got a nice little place here as well. And then if you just kind of take a quick, I don't know if it's easy to see with this, but they, they give it that uh, carbon fiber look, I would say. Um, it's not really carbon fiber, but they give it the look. So it has a nice, they call the shielded look there. And this is the Inwin Buck, one of their newest, uh, kind of mid-range to almost enthusiast gaming case. Very feature-rich, very affordable, very compact and nice.